Hello and welcome to the solution video for spicy question number 18. In this question we have a sector and we're told its radius is 6cm so let's mark that onto the diagram. We're also told the area of that sector is 25 pi centimeters squared. So this sector here has an area of 25 pi. To find the area of any sector you need to know its angle so let's mark on the angle here. Since we don't know this one we'll call it theta. So the area of a sector is theta divide by 360, times by pi, and then times by the radius squared. We know the radius though, that's 6. And we know for this one, this must equal 25 pi. We can simplify 6 squared, that's 36. And if we times this left hand side together, we get 36 theta over 360 times pi, which is equal to 25 pi. You can now divide both sides by pi, so the pi's will cancel out and you get 36 theta over 360 equals 25. On the left hand side, 36 goes into 360 10 times, so that's just a tenth, so it's theta over 10 equals 25, and if we times both sides by 10, then theta equals 25 times 10, which is 250 degrees. So we can add that to the diagram. Now the question wants us to work out the area of the semicircle, which is this one here. To find the area of any circle, you need to know its radius, so I'm going to mark a line from the centre of the circle, which is at A, straight down until we hit the line OP. This will form a right angled triangle. We have the angle inside the major sector, 250 degrees, and going to mark on the angle on the outside of that sector here. Both of those angles must add up to 360, so the green one is 360, take 250, which is 110. Now we're also told in the question that the line OP bisects the angle AOB. So OP splits that angle in half, so if we half 110 we just get the top bit. Half of 110 is 55 degrees. We now have a really nice right angled triangle. The angle in the bottom corner is 55 degrees, and the hypotenuse is 6 centimetres. We could do with finding the vertical height of this triangle, because that would be the radius of the semicircle. So, if we label this triangle, we have the hypotenuse which is 6, the opposite, and the adjacent, and we'd like to find the opposite, so we can use sine. So sine of 55 equals the opposite, divide by the hypotenuse, which is 6. So the opposite must be equal to 6 times sine 55, which gives you 4.914912266, and so on. So we found the vertical height of this triangle, which is also the radius of the semicircle. So to find the area of the semicircle, we'll use the formula area equals pi times the radius squared, and this will give you 75.8894512, but that's the whole circle and we only want the semicircle, so we divide this by 2, and the question asks for the answer to be to one decimal place, which gives you 37.9 centimetres squared. And that's your answer to the question. Thank you for watching this video, I hope you found it useful. Check out the one I think you should watch next and subscribe so you don't miss out on future videos.